is welcoming a new vegan restaurant with healthy options. Joining us this morning from Native Foods Cafe in Encinitas is the executive chef, Kendall Huff. Just flew in from Chicago, especially for us today. Welcome. Thank you. Thank so you for having me. This, this is a great concept, and I am shocked that San Diego wouldn't have jumped on board earlier for a totally vegan restaurant. Well, they're on board now, so yeah. we're super pumped. So we're what, excited. Is that the concept? I mean, everything is healthy and vegan. Everything is. Everything is plant-based, 100% plant-based, and it's made from scratch daily. So everything is completely fresh, including our proteins. We make our homemade seitan and tempeh in-house. Oh, nice. Okay. Yeah. And so just refresh our memories. Vegan means exactly what? Uh, no animal products. Okay, so, so that includes no cheese and cheese, eggs. no dairy, no eggs, uh, no honey, because bees have eyes. Okay. So okay. everything is 100% plant. Okay, now, now you say that, but you have brought so many delicious options. Lots of goodies going on over here. So first we have, um, today, well, today we're going to make our bistro steak sandwich, which is super, super tasty. Um, we take our peppered seitan here. Um, we do a nice little marinade of soy, lemon juice, very garlicky. Mm -hmm. um, then we have our oven roasted tomatoes, uh, fresh thyme, roasted garlic. Um, and then we have our homemade blue cheese right here, which is a uh, firm tofu mixed with the veginase, a little bit of lime for that little, I'm sorry, lemon okay. for a zing. Okay, zing, okay. And then we have our crispy shallots and then that bitter arugula going on in there. So okay. that's what we're going to make. And then we also have all these goodies. Well, go here. ahead and start cooking because yeah. I got I to gotta know this is the steak sandwich, but it obviously is. it's not steak. So, no. so what do what is the reaction for people who may not be vegan? To try, it. is it does it does it taste? Does it give you that satisfying steak feeling? It does. It does. It has that 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 heavy kind of meaty flavor, mm -hmm. if you will. Um, and the best thing about seitan is, is you can do whatever you want with it. You can season it, you can marinate it, you can grill it, you can get crazy with it. Mm -hmm. um, and we do, we do get crazy <laughs> with it. It sounds like you do. Yeah, oh yeah, we have a lot of fun. So um, for this particular one, um, seitan is, is, is a great kind of yoga process. It takes a while to make and it's super, super fun and relaxing. Um, for our peppered seitan, um, we throw in like, oh, you can see the fresh peppercorns in mm -hmm. here, a little bit of spice action going on there. And then from that loaf, we slice it, marinate it, and then we're gonna plate up an awesome sandwich here. So it's nice and, meaty to the tip, like to the touch. Okay. Now, while this gets going, describe yeah. some of the other foods because you have a lot of options, I know. We do. We do. We have a lot of stuff going on. So right up front here is our portobello sausage burger. This is another one of our seitans. It's a sausage seitan. Mm -hmm. We have freshly grilled portobello mushrooms, a pomodoro salsa, tomatoes, mm. basil, very Italiano. Nice. Um, Molto bene. Yeah. Oh, that was great. Thank you. Um, fresh basil. And then over here we have our rakin marakin. Um, <laughs> a lot of great spices in there. On the bottom we have the power uh, protein of quinoa. Oh, our yeah. grilled veggies, zucchini, uh, sweet potatoes, broccolis. And then this is our tofu right on top. Mm -hmm. Over here we have our Caribbean jerk salad. Um, it's a really great lime kind of cilantro going on here and then a mango uh, red pepper red onion kind of a chip all these veggies and yummy stuff yeah. in there and delicious then right here is our homemade tempeh so this gets a nice jerk kind of spice on there all spice little cinnamon going on okay. Um, these are our homemade chicken wings. And so it's obviously not chicken. It is not chicken. What is it? It's a mixture between uh, soy, pea, and wheat protein. Okay. And then what we do is we double batter. We make an awesome coconut, cumin, garlic batter. Double batter it so it's nice and crispy <sighs> on the outside. You're making and us hungry. Gooey on the inside. I know, and you smell this? We are wafting. Unfortunately, out of time, Chef. Can you wow. tell us where you're located while you finish this up for yes, us? Yes, yes, for sure. So um, we currently have 14 restaurants, and the one here in Encinitas is um, 127. North, um, I want to say Camino Real. Camino Real. Yeah, got it. Real. Okay, there yeah, it we know right where that is. Right You're from on. Chicago. We I know. understand. I'm from Chicago. I'm <laughs> no so worries. Confused. Awesome. Okay, so it's um, it's open, ready to go. Native Foods Cafe. Ready to rock. El Camino Real in Encinitas. Chef, thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming. That's a beautiful Earth, thing. <laughs> you keep cooking. Keep going. Keep we're going to take out. a quick break, but we will show you the finished product because you know we're on till 10 a.m. And uh, Brandy Williams is in Balboa Park this morning. Brandy? Hey, good morning, guys. What's the perfect thing to do on a rainy, chilly Friday? Stay in and eat Girl Scout cookies. Yes, it's the last weekend to get them. I'll give you all the details when Good Morning San Diego returns.